as I'm making this video, we got 12 days, 12 hours, and 54 minutes to the great eclipse. March 27th. Boy, I tell you, I didn't want to make videos, but as I'm not going to give up. As of today, March 27th, Wednesday, Comet 12P, the Ancient One. It's in the Aries constellation. We have over here a lineup of planets, basically in Aquarius. Today, we have the moon and the foot of Virgo approaching the scale of justice. Coma diameter is hard to see. Over 600,000 kilometers, almost half the size of the sun. The tail is over 10 million kilometers easily, probably more. We have the comet in the constellation Aries approaching the head on Easter of the ram. Here's Uranus. Looking at JPL NASA site, and they have updated it on the 20th of March, which is over a week ago, at 7,427 observations, which is approximately 25,600 days of observation. Remember, in July 29th, it was 1,440. Now, looking at the number one, Haley, they adjusted the numbers to 8,548 with observations of over 57,852 days, the equivalent of 158 years. First observed in 1835, so that they raised the number, so st which still puts Haley number one spot with those no, no those adjusted numbers. But Comet 12P is still is number two, solid number two, second place, which will soon, it'll pass it. They could keep adjusting that numbers but it will it will pass surpass it because comet 12p doesn't the closest approach to earth is june 2nd june 2nd not the 8th not the 15th not the 17th june 2nd today they got the, the magnitude at 4.5 21st when it's perihelion closest to the sun 3.7 nearest approach june 2nd 5.5 this is the current chart they have as of today the 27th at a 4.5 question is would it reach a four by the eclipse right here anything above if we have another one of these outbursts like it had in the past would this jump up into the three range for the eclipse don't know now you're gonna still gonna have people saying there's nothing nothing to worry here folks everything's just fine here's an image of the comet still have that spiral characteristics to it in this image here it's crazy it looked like a buzzsaw, a buzzsaw. Now we head to Comet Watch on Facebook. This was posted a day ago. Same characteristics. But look at the, the influence it's having on the outer shell. It's definitely expanding. And it looks more, without thinking, more violent looking. Now this image here was posted two hours ago by that gentleman right there, Alex. And look at the, the beauty of it at all. Now this image here, posted four or five hours ago, you can see distortion here, like chunks breaking off. And I have more information on that from the latest report from the, the British Astronomical Association. This image here, taken on five hours ago on the 26th, shows the same characteristics right here. It was posted 13 hours ago, also by Jarrett, one of the top notch in the business. Now looking at that spiral, got one, two, three, basically three spires look like a buzzsaw and you can see the the outer shell the the magnetic barrier this here the plasma tail just gushing water what type of water who knows probably virgin water like swimming in space being revealed 12 hours ago by this gentleman right here same thing clear spiral spread out how spread out it is now this here the outer shell it's over 600,000 100 kilometers estimate when i talk about the magnetic field line and the magnetic barrier i'm referring to this right here think of this as like a like a bubble it does have some sort of shield some sort of magnetic feel in my opinion i still go with magnetic feel 26 it just got that appearance doesn't it folks this is not a normal looking comet by far i've never seen anything like this 
And I've been covering comets for a while, three decades, and I've never seen anything that looks like this. Maybe maybe somebody else, maybe I took a week off or a month off, and maybe one did show up, but I've never seen anything like this ever. These are from the 25th. Just looking at some of this stuff, I mean, looking at the, the jets, the characteristic, remember, it changed shape every every time i mean if i take a picture right now and five minutes later i won't get the same image that's how it constantly is changing so there we have it with the images this comet is definitely different now heading towards the Brit mentioned earlier british astronomical association great site they have it at a five magnitude it was last updated on the 23rd now we click on the link right here and it gives you a preliminary report on it right off the bat what i get is right here fragmentation that catches the attention this right here now if we google that we'll get this more more on the study it's rather like watching an iceberg carve off a glacier that's what's happening with this fragmentation it's been reported already before i mean con whether continue outbursts and with what frequency it should become a naked eye object reaching a four magnitude say around mid-april that explains a lot and other images from and comments comment that were made in reference to to this event this has happened before in the past with the mid 73p comet inky comet over there by jupiter when jupiter had a, its encounter this is not, nothing new i'm at 488 subscribers 12 away from the magic 500 i was going to stop doing videos after this one but i got encouragement from a lot of individuals mostly all women and girls telling me to don't stop because this concerned about they're aware of the eclipse and how this ties in with the eclipse like i said all roads will is going to lead to the eclipse i mean my stuff i put these tags on for example hit solar eclipse for example you won't find my content at all so you know that the, and i've been studying a lot of this about the solar eclipse everybody's finding revelations being provided dreams insights and i have no clue who that lady is i keep seeing this video here i have no clue who this person is right here there's so much mysteries so much revelations being revealed remember keep your eyes on the sun the moon and the stars for signs this is what the news is about the eclipse it's a lot of fascinating I, I provided some links that provided some real good insights again i don't have no clue who that lady that old lady is but you see her a lot being put on these thumbnails apparently she must be somebody that knows something i mean checked out this video right here he provides a lot of information so the eclipse a lot of there was an eclipse a partial eclipse on the 25th of, i think it was 13 days later, now we're going to get the, the American eclipse, the great, the great eclipse over 13 states. Wonder if anybody put that into the equation. Yes, the eclipse. See what I mean? A lot of views. And I did listen to some of that video here. I don't know. We got the eclipse coming up. We got weather, earthquakes with that comet coming around. It's having an effect. The sun. Check, take a look at the sun. Okay, looking at space weather today, March 27th, Wednesday. He writes about the the X-Class effects. Taking a look at stereo on the 27th. Oh, look like we have more activity from the sun. This is today. I mean, it doesn't look big, but still, the sun is just still giving out. So, on the 27th. Okay, that's all I have. Hope some of this made some sense. Thank the ladies for, for helping me out. The old man needed a kick in the butt, get out, uh, get back in the game. Kind of depressed because uh, my health problems is deteriorating too. Boy, I tell you, I got more incoming that you wouldn't believe. Health fronts deteriorating, my left eye, my right foot. Might lose my eye, might lose a toe. But I'm still here. I still have the spirit and I'm still doing the mission. I mean, I still got the home. And I pray to God that the ones representing me will help me in Jesus' name. So, still here. Please uh, give me a thumbs up. Subscribe. Give me 500. Let's uh, get the old man some change. And I'll continue. And I'll, I'll be more motivated. But please understand the situation that I'm currently, fa currently facing. I never even imagined that I'd be get this high. I just did this just for fun. I mean, not for fun. Just document comets when I first started. And it's grown. And it's growing. 
I'm just 12, 12 away from cracking that magic number, which means a lot. And I thank you and I appreciate you all. Hang with the old man. I mean, it's life. I'm one of those old-fashioned, hard-headed men from the past, from the 50s and 60s. And like I stated before in other videos, I didn't want to come back. But here I am. I'm not worried. I'm not worried, you know, and you shouldn't be worried either. This is here for a reason. We're chosen to witness this. We're here. We're here to experience this. God is showing, shining the light more and more. More revelations will be seen in the, the moon, the sun, and the stars, comets, everything. There's too many revelations that match. Too many coincidences. Too many data, dots, pieces of the puzzle. They all connect. Thing. And those that have been covering this, and people have the interest because look at your views count. And remember, you're, you're probably seed censored and shadow be like me. So who knows how much views or more ten more that you have. I know I am and I know I'm I'm reaching and I'm hoping I'm helping I'm helping. Uh also to 1954 when the last time this uh comet passed that I forgot to mention in this video here. It it did have an effect on the west coast of uh, the United States where Oregon and Washington a sudden spike in earthquake activity and movement volcanic and also so I thought forgot to mention that i had to study I was reading it should have put it in the video but i didn't sorry i'm not great and i'm not i'm doing the best i can this will be number video number 46 on this comet and pretty soon i'm going to transition into the the solar eclipse so i'm going to be covering the solar eclipse i'm going to be merging and providing my insights and my take and who to who to check out for news on the solar eclipse rex hello rex we need you you're you're getting visions God's giving you visions. You're like me, <laughs> like Jonah. <laughs> we don't want to do it, but we got to do it. <laughs> okay, until next time. I'll see you later. Thank you, Lord, for this day. Bye-bye.